here cleaning up my inventory. I uh, got a little caught up in it. This is why I'm a little bit late to the stream. Less than five minutes, but still a little bit late. Uh, yeah. I feel like we're getting close to the end. Uh, I decided that I would do some inventory management. Uh, that's what I'm in the middle of right now. Uh, I'm, I'm nearly there. I just have to move everything up so new stuff doesn't uh, interrupt my organization. And then maybe I can uh, edit it so that the distribution of weight is a little more equal. I don't know how many of these keys I have to keep, but I'm a key collector. I collect the keys, and the starfish is uh, our mascot, so it's going to stay here. So you can see there's like a nice handy like, oh, this is an item you don't want. Let's put it in the cell category that I wasn't making good use of beforehand. But I'm going to start making use of it now. Lazelle's holding a flute. I don't know if the flute does anything. I don't really want to sell it right away just in case it does. And uh, I'm just here. <sighs> About to organize Shadow Hearts. I might have to look at what all of my... Uh, what do my scrolls do? So I might have to, uh... Like, use or get rid of some of these scrolls. So I just have a lot of them. And there's definitely not enough space for them to be on my action bars. So I just have too many. Some of them are really useful. I could give a lot of them to Gale and have him learn a ton of spells for free. Which is kind of nice. See, miss, miss, whoa. When did I get this? Mysterious artifact. A many-sided box of blackened iron engraved with pulsating ruins. Something stirs within. When did I pick this up? Why does Shadowheart have this? Why is it a story item? Mames target on hit. What does that mean? I would have to see what the mame condition means. But uh, these spears are interesting, but I can't do anything with it. I got the Blade of Frontier's Eye, which is interesting. Uh, the Priestess's Journal I want to put down here. Let's put all of the food items up front and center. Followed by potions. These could go to wares and then be at the bottom. Uh, beer, wine, night frond. Fire, wine, bottle. Small bottle could go to wares. Torturer's key. Potion of poison. There might be a way that we could slip that into someone's drink. But I guess Shadowheart's now just going to hold on to a bunch of alcohol. Oh, I missed a single squirrel. It's fine. I mean, she does have an entire barrel of fire wine. Hey, what's up? Name of Jimmy. Hey, how's it going? Billy said you left the dildo at his house last night. Well... Unfortunate, Billy. Uh, I'm gonna need that back. Thank you. Hawkward. All right. I don't think they need the pouch anymore. So the beginning of this is going to be, uh... Evil! Hey, Jerry, how's it going? The beginning of this stream is going to be pretty much me just, like, fixing things up. 
So, it'll take a little bit. Just a little bit of time. Uh, it's something I've been putting off way, way, way too long. So my uh, inventories were a mess. And now I like need to know what I have. And once I know what I have, things will be better. Said he done good last night, but he don't want his GF to know that he's cheating. Hey, sans, sans Marco 7. Like, it was a fun joke to begin with, but, like, it's going on just a little too far. Hey, good man. So Sans Marco, that's uh that's just too far, man. So uh and that's probably gonna be the the last time, you know, that I say that before I have my mods take action. So like we're here to have a fun time. Yeah, I know you're just kidding. Like, it's a good joke at first, you know? You're just going it a little bit too far. Alright. Though a bloom of mold has leached the ink from most of this scroll, its beginnings is still legible. The sealing ritual. Da, da, da. I think I already read of this one. Yeah, for sure. that. Okay, so last we left off, we had just found our way to the Underdark. Which is a scary, like, large, laborious, like, uh, encounter. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna go check out a couple of things before I go into the Underdark. I was made aware... I was... <laughs> I played this a little bit multiplayer, and I realized that I missed a, a potential companion that I'm gonna go back and pick up while I, like, also complete the getting healed quest, or as much of it as I can. So I doubt he's gonna be able to actually uh, heal me. But uh, after that's all said and done, we'll go spelunking. Underdark, like your bubble. Thanks for the follow, Navy Jimmy. <laughs> Throw a guiding bolt over here. Toxin. I have a couple food items you have. I could throw that. Okay. 
Food, alcohol, water, we got it all. Potion. Throne vials. Okay. This is going to have to be good enough for now. All the different arrows that I could do. It'll be great. Grease bottle, fire bottle, potion of sleep, and some acid. Okay. So do that, do a quick save. Excited to see the Underdark. I'm excited for the Underdark too. Uh, but I'm 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 gonna let it sit just for a second. Um, even though it's gonna be like kind of a problem to get back to it, we're gonna go to Sylvanas Throne Grove. The organization is very pleasing. It's way better than I previously had it organized. So let's go try to pick up Will, and we're going to see how Halson responds to uh, all of the druids being dead. So we saved Halson, but the... Uh, and Halson's there. Oh, Zevlor is here. Interesting. A scout just reported. The goblin's leadership has been decimated. We might escape this place yet. I took a collection from all of us. It isn't much, but you've earned it. Modview doesn't allow theater? That is silly. Thank you. It's not enough, but it's all we have. Let's be eager to get moving again. We have put our lives on hold long enough. Just a little longer now, thankfully. But perhaps we need not speak of farewells. We'll join your camp tonight to celebrate if you'll have us. My people are ready to leave when you are. Yeah, in my view, a lot for theater mode, that'd be nice. Uh, not just, just yet. Just give the word. I have to go with you? Pack together sack. Just have a light hammer, water, a tart, thieves tool, a potion, only 12 gold, spilled mashed potatoes. I should kill him for his insolence. Thief like Marty! Well, let's check in with Halson. With the leadership dead, no attack will be mounted on the grove. I am in your debt, my friend. Oh, he hasn't seen that the uh, druids are dead. That's good. Oh. <laughs> the other druids are dead. They turned on us. We had to ha- uh, What about my problems? Soon. First, I must set matters to rights in the grove. And you should celebrate your victory. Yeah, hey, After being dormant for so long, your infection is unlikely to produce new symptoms spontaneously. Tomorrow morning, we shall discuss what is to come. Uh, enough delays. I want to be cured now. Then go forth. There are no easy paths to what you seek. If you seek my aid, you must show patience. Yep, grass point of view. This is great. The other druids are dead. They turned on us. We had to defend ourselves. Yes, you did. You acted according to your instincts, to nature. This is my mm. fault. I was not here to guide them. Now they rest forever while I carry the weight of my failings. But the grove still stands, even if they do not. Thanks to you. Yeah, we didn't have to reap for uh, killing the druids. This is good. I hope this grove of yours is worth the bloodshed. Believe me, it is. The span of a mortal life isn't enough to grasp the importance of this place. Its roots touch everything. Yeah, he's so nice. Uh, last stream, we talked to the dead Mind Flayer, and he just gave us a little bit more backstory to what's going on, but not, like, a ton. Uh, we cleared out the entirety of that goblin room, 
Uh, we failed once trying to do barrel tactics, and then we just cleared a room, and then cheesed it with barrel tactics, and everything worked fine. Uh, we rescued this druid, we found the entrance to the Underdark, and now we're here. He definitely gonna kill- he can't kill me. Halson and the Tiefling later? <laughs> On a date of both, TVH. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, what happens next? Rest, heal, celebrate if you wish, mourn if you must. Come morning, we shall discuss delivering you from your parasite. Okay. So I have to go take a long rest. Oh, what's going on here? Ended, the next soon to begin. Oh, you're usually the person I sold to. For a normal day. Oh no, you were the person whose whose child died. That's right. Ooh, I actually. Don't know where the where our companion is anymore. He used to be over here, but we went too far in the story, and I bet he's somewhere else now. So we won't be able to recruit Will yet. All right, what's going on here? All that talk of fighting, you spared us that. Thank you. Oh, I don't think the person I can sell to is even here anymore, because we gotta move along. Okay. Well... I have to find a place where I can sell stuff. Yeah, I mean, it could happen. If we missed that on Will, it's not the worst thing in the world. He was a warlock, I'm a warlock. Yeah. So I... So I guess I'm gonna save and then maybe I'll go escort these tieflings. Time, Hopefully they take Let's me to go. a place where I can sell stuff. Ready to head to your camp. Are you? Yeah, let's Excellent. go. Lead the way. Wait, they're going to my camp. We're ready to head to your camp. Are you? Just give the word. They're coming to my camp. Okay. Interesting. So I may have killed the only other shopkeeper in this game. <laughs> so let's go to the Ugly Dark. <laughs> Why is it a problem? Oh, you're all fighting me and such. Okay. Um. Killed him with a barrel at least. No, that was a group of people who I just like broke into a town and bashed them like a couple days ago. I did kill the uh, other goblin leader with a barrel. Ah, <sighs> Shadowheart. Okay. I'm pretty sure once you kill this guy, uh, everyone stops fighting you. Nope, that was uh, before we killed the entire leadership. Now that we killed the whole leadership, they're just going to kill me. Or try. Uh, you can stay there. Oh. 
Nice. Big one damage, and there's the rest of the party. Okay. This is a little more problematic than I initially thought. <laughs> Should be fine. People are gonna start coming in from this way, huh? Tears protection. Oh, wonderful. We'll just funnel them all in here. This is fine. This is fine. Most of these goblins are, like, super weak. It's only this, like, big ogre guard that I'm really gonna have trouble with, I think. And then just getting, like, peppered with arrows. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. That's pretty nice. Wait, isn't this place you didn't want to attack yesterday? Yes. It's I didn't think teleporting in would make them all attack me, but uh, teleporting in made them all attack me. I did level up to level 4 also at some point. I think that was in the, uh, the stream you missed. So everyone's significantly stronger than I was the last time I did this fight. It should make the fight, like, a lot easier. They do. They have a lot of barrels that I could try to steal. Eventually. Alright. Was all your standing in fire? Can't quite make it there. Can you kill out a sacred flame? You can! Wonderful. There's so a warlock over this way. Left we'll Shadow Heart start heading this way. Must adopt all the bears. Yeah. Yeah, the barrels are uh, not very useful when we can't get the jump in combat, though. Nice. They keep trying to sleep my half elf, and that's amazing. Alright, so the things I have to worry about are the ogre and the bugbear. Um, ogre's coming down the pass right now. I can make it all the way over here to hit this one, but let's kill the warlock first. Perfect. Okay. Barrel him? I can't barrel him. Like, if I barreled him, I'm going to end up hurting myself too much at this point. At least I think. So I don't have the height to throw the barrel very far. The barrel might not be that bad of an idea. I don't share initiative with anyone. Shouldn't worry about the conjured wolf. Nice. Okay. Oh! <laughs> Ragdolled a bit into that area. That's fine. So, the good news is most of the small goblins we should be able to one-shot with most of our characters. Spaghetti mode. It's just throwing rocks. Brute. Um. Poison. Do we acid arrow too? Ooh, 
nice. Those arrows are super useful. The rock from Evil Jason's AP. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that was the rock he threw, huh? I had almost forgot. Just got blown back. I'll take an attack of opportunity from the wolf. That should be fine. Target's too far. Okay, that's fine. Could just attack the wolf. No point in having her take unnecessary damage. Yeah, two barrels, one attack. I could kill the ogre right away. If I'm lucky. Yeah, now that more people are clustered, I'm definitely gonna try it. As long as Lazelle doesn't go to sleep. Okay. Lazelle didn't go to sleep, but she is here. He's over there. I'm, uh, I'm just gonna have Lizelle go nuts right now. She's hasted, so she gets extra attacks. No, attack it. Please. Okay. Well, she was going to go nuts until she missed twice in a row. Okay, see you, Jerry. Should have used the barrel. And all right, I, I I know I know the barrel's good. I understand. Look, there we go. So I didn't want to use a, Lizelle, a barrel on top of Lizelle over here. Baldur's Gate three equals divinity original sin. Yeah, kind of Jamie Amy. Also, throwing that was just a bonus action. Oh, that's that's not right. Fallout oh, seventy six level of glitches. I mean, it is an early access. Hmm. Random alarm clock. Alright, sure you are, guard Gurgan. Sure you're gonna smash. Uh, I don't exactly want to waste it on the conjured wolf. Did you come through this way? Try to get the shot here. Too many nat ones. Didn't get the two minute effect. Yeah, didn't get the two minute one. This wolf is just, like, annoying. It's not really that dangerous. But it's just sitting there. Oh, that's bad. Ooh. 
that person's got to die. It's a pretty powerful spellcaster. All right. Come on, how many ones am I gonna roll? Thank you. All right. Unfortunate. Yeah. Well, sometimes bad luck happens. Man, this Conjured Wolf has... What are the chances of random getting that twice in a row? Ugh. Oh. Um... Disengage to here? No, 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 no! I clicked on Eldritch Blast. Oh, that's so bad. Okay. Um, you don't have a barrel, do you? He does not have a barrel. But I can sneak attack you. I guess rid of the bugbear. Yeah. That was unfortunate. The idea was really good. I clicked on Eldritch Blast, but it didn't work. Maybe I should just use keybinds there. Make it safer. Alright. Really need to get rid of this wolf. 60% chance to hit with that, only 55 with that. Alright, just kill the wolf, Shadowheart. Shadowheart, come on. Sounds like Blizzard to you. Yeah. Alright. Come on, let's actually kill this one this time. There we go. There we go. Uh, I really need you to get over to this ogre. Yeah, we can do that. We're hasted. Wonderful. Um, 1d10 plus 4. Yeah, let's go ahead and use second wind here, too. Perfect. Alright, great. Only a 56% chance to hit? Why is my chance to hit so low? Am I afflicted with something? Dark One's Blessing, Potion... I'm threatened? I must be attacking into melee somehow. What am I threatened by? I don't think jumping anywhere would get me out of threatened. But I'm gonna try it. Yeah, there we go. When you're threatened and you try to make an attack, uh, a ranged attack, you have disadvantage on it, which is why the hit chance was so low there. I'll fire my laser. Yep. Conjured Wolf is having issues. Oh! 
Ooh. Horse. I'll roll five nat ones and then get crit. That's fine. It's like it had disengaged, huh? It's still a disengage. Takes my bonus action. Shadow Heart. Oh, I'm out of first level spells. I really don't want to waste a second level spell here. Just kill it. Shadow Heart, come on! It's 60% three turns in a row. You've missed. Yeah, this feels like yesterday. Oh no, Lazelle went to sleep. And that's a crit on my guy. Oh, that person's a healer. We should be fine. Uh... pretty bad. What do you mean? Oh no. That's bad. So haste does work like 5e. After your turns of haste you are stunned for a round. So Moselle's about to get bopped. There's nothing I can do about it. I don't want to create the acid surface. How oh, I might be able to save Lazelle here. So if I use an arrow of darkness. It did not use the arrow of darkness. Okay. Oh, but he missed! Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Alright. This time. Wonderful! You did it! Great. Hide, dip, shove. Wonderful. Alright, good dodge. Oh, that's bad. It's fine. Wonderful. Now I need you to jump out of the fire. Over to here. No, don't! What was that? Alright, you can't go down. That was so weird. I hit jump, but then I moved. I was... Uh, I don't like how that works. 
can you shoot this guy? I can. Wonderful. Spellcaster's out of the way. It did not tell me it would put me into the acid. It's cool. Cool, cool, cool. You know what? It's fine. We're gonna be fine. Jumping is really overpowered. Sixty-five percent, also sixty-five percent. It's fine. We should definitely win this fight at this point. Like, even if people go down, I should be able to bring them back up and finish the fight. Let's get rid of this one. Wonderful. Then go up here threaten this guy. What a shot. Alright, disengaged. There's the archer over here. There's two of them. Get rid of... Ah, oh, we didn't kill that one. Unfortunate. Have you drink one of these? There's one right here. Oh, that sucks. I got up here. Oh, let's try just attacking. Wonderful shadow art. You did it. Make one of these so you don't go down. And hide behind this corner. Perfect. I guess I wasn't far enough behind that corner. Job. Can I actually? <laughs> Surprise! Alright. Let's get a little bit of extra distance with the jump. Even though it does take some of my movement to jump to begin with. Target's too far. Can I see this one? I can. Ooh, we hit. Let's have her dash. Uh, can you not get close enough, Shadowheart? Alright. It's fine. We did it. <sighs> Dang it! Such a cool play if she didn't fall over. <laughs> yeah, finally she hit something. Alright. 
be good for you. And you have no movement. We did it! <laughs> My name is Shadowheart, and this is Jackass. For some reason, the Autobahn was saying Jackass was was not allowed. It's odd. Alright. Do our quick autosave there. Right, quick save. Have people eat food. <laughs> Man, that food gives so much health. Potentially. Wonderful. Go ahead and save again now that we're healed. Missed that whole fight. Good job, though. Well, thanks. It was a lot easier now that we're level 4. There's someone singing? He doesn't have to know. <laughs> yeah, 4 is the max level in early access. So I am at max level. Uh, there's still things that I could go do though. Uh, I figure there's going to be some fights and some things that are just going to be too hard for me though. But uh... Just, uh get all my rewards here. Wait, what is this? Uh, mm. Alizel doesn't care. She'll eat dwarf. Oh, these are all dwarf. Dwarf parts. This is all dwarf. Hey, Shadowheart, you take the ribs. Didn't realize. That was all dwarf guts. All right, to the underdark. Just use barrels, they don't need levels to... What is this? I didn't know there was a fight in here that I just skipped. Alright. Way to go, Shadowheart. Too too high?
What about the dwarf meat? If you don't have a dwarf eating it, then I don't think it's illegal. Or something like that. Calkinson. Lawful evil, Cody the neutral evil. <laughs> Their reactions to the circumstance. <laughs> Not enough movement. If I jump, can I get enough movement? Interesting. So jumping does give you more movement than you should have. That's a little strange. Man, they're really good shots. So they have the... I think what Larian really likes to do is they like to give uh, an incredible bonus to hitting ranged attacks if you're up on a ledge and shooting down at someone. So we're going to have Shadow Heart come up here. I'm like, I want her to stand like over here. Perfect. Oh wait! The way to shoot is to climb up this ladder. And then shoot that way. Shoot this guy. Let's go shoot this one. Nice! Alright. I don't know why that didn't count as sneak attack, but he must be in dim light. That's my only thought. Give her an extra 2 AC. One extra exploit, like the jumping exploit. Potentially. Like, it also might be, like, calculating it as an athletics check to see if you could get extra movement from your jump. Which, like, isn't necessarily, like, something that doesn't exist in 5e. Check something with uh, Shadow Heart real quick. Does he have this weapon? Okay, so it just has a chance to catch Fairy Fire whenever I hit something. It's fine. Okay. Go over this way. Yep, just keep going. Perfect. Wonderful. Shadowheart versus the world. I don't think I'll have enough movement to jump here. You also have the light cantrip now, right? You do.
That should end the fight. Nice. And save. So now I should come to the point where uh, everything's dead, and I could just walk through. Except for like these merchants over here that we super stole from. So that door is open now. And Gribbo, who's not gonna fight us, because we let Volo out. Um. There was one area I didn't explore to its fullest. It was over this way. So I don't think my main character could jump over there. So he has those Cast light on Lazelle. We're gonna have Lazelle go on her own for a second. Use a crate. I could use a crate to get everyone over here. But I don't think there's gonna be much over here. It's actually just a dead end. Weird. There's an NPC that ran off this direction as if there were an en entrance or an exit this way. But I guess it was just supposed to be a set piece. Weird. Okay. Well, we got some gold going over there. It's not completely worthless. Okay. So the Underdark is going to be a fresh a fresh new uh, location full of terrors. I imagine it being very big and uh, full of all different kind of points to navigate. So we'll do our best. Underdark is also full of like really powerful creatures. Oh, this place is still on fire from my last time here. It's good that they don't have them automatically run through the fire anymore. Which is what I was expecting to happen. So, big upside there. <laughs> 